almost got your personality on fire. He saw it. Guess we'll have to connect that film. You know what? We might as well just audit, edit that into a short. He's gonna light his personality on I thought about shaving all of it off again because I just got the perfect Charlie Brown going <laughs> right now. <sighs> you did wear that for a little while. Like a week or uh, something. Um, yes, Kim Jong, Kim Jong Un just came up. Mm. And, uh, well, it was interesting. It was the idea of how that poor guy was saying, what good friends they are, and they had a, he wrote them a, that, that Kim Jong-un had writ, read, written him a love letter, and others, which, he doesn't get to keep that. It's just like every gift the president gives, gives, and one girl was sad the day she said, I met Bill Clinton, and I said, oh, okay, and she said, yes, and she said, and um, I gave him my personal Bible and had it a uh, verse, you know, noted about it. And he said, yay, all right. And he was very friendly and he smiled. And I said, you know, he doesn't keep that Bible, right? And she said, no, I gave it to him. I said, no. I said, every present that the President of the United States gets goes in the vault somewhere. That is the property of the people. It's the property of the people. You are a representative of the nation when somebody gifts you something. Which, funny enough, I think that if people are giving campaign money to somebody that is an incumbent president, a candidate that should go to the people because it was given to them as the president. Oh boy, I just stirred up a can of worms, didn't I? Oh, you've got my attention. Mind blowing experience. You've got my attention. Holy shit. No president should even need to fucking campaign. Any president who's doing their job should let their fucking resume speak for them. They don't have to argue. Plead the fifth. Why would I say something that's going to make me look bad? You know? Ha! And so this love letter that Kim Jong-un, he likes knowing his surname. He doesn't know surname versus fucking given name Christian name versus fucking real name. He doesn't know anything. But he, he just knows that name Kim. He can masturbate to him all day long. Like he's a little North Korean woman dressed up like a dictator. <laughs> he doesn't get to keep that letter. He's not allowed to keep that letter. So... Here, I'm thinking he's loving him so much and we're talking about this, I'm hearing this, uh, about this Kim Jong-un love, my best friend. He's my best friend that I've ever had. Ha, da, ha, da, ha, da, 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 da. Worst Queen song in the world. <laughs> I shut it off every time. And I don't like a lot of Queen, but I will let most of it play. I can't stand that song. And so, yeah, they're best friends. They're dancing in the park like fucking Tenacious D, like uh, Jack Black and Rage, Cage, Kyle. Uh, best friends dancing in the sand. 
and you think, okay, this is the story we get. And we know what Putin thought about him because they've got these things talking about how they were talking in their cabinets and things. This is the best thing. Not like they're going to take over America through this guy or anything, but he's such a joke. He's such a clown. Just like Bill Cooper says in Behold a Pale Horse, you will have a leader be a clown so nobody can trust their government anymore and then they will need your help and you will show them the way. That's what Putin, and we know that they were looking at it like that, this fucking clown. And uh, right. we know that Putin still wants good things to be That's said about so him because his, his press can share this to their people and it will help our country fail more. Our country. The country I was born in. This ain't my country, but it's the country of my birth. Yeah. Um, but what does the North Korean people think about us? You think about that. They had Kim Jong-un they're best friends. He comes back, they leave, and Kim Jong-un's watching on, you know, Fox News, CNN. It used to, I always used to say just CNN, but I guess they've got a political fucking uh, thing now, so I don't know who to say anymore. I was just thinking of a news channel, and they're saying, uh, you know, I hope he's watching that the same way Saddam Hussein was to see what we were supposed to be doing, right? Supposedly, and he's he's that he's looking good to Trump at least. The Americans are like, what the fuck? But if Trump says it and he knows that, at least half the people, ooh, demon got its wings ah. about three times because I didn't call it the first time, right? Oh, that poor guy. I didn't even mean to say his name because it's obvious who I'm talking about, but wow, it's become background noise, that name. Didn't want anybody else to win, we just wanted him to lose. Schwarzenegger Freeman. That's right. And so he's seeing this, but we don't see what they say. I gotta imagine he's going to his people, the North Koreans, who in the book World War Z, the zombie apocalypse, <laughs> not the movie, but the okay, book, okay. That this guy was going around the world and seeing how it was going. And in North Korea, the way they beat it, they were finding ways to beat the zombie fucking infection. The way they found it in North Korea was... They just busted out all their fucking teeth. Oh, my God. <laughs> wow. Nobody had teeth. They couldn't fucking bite you. So that's the way they looked at North Korea, and that's the way we see North Korea, and that's pretty much the way I think North Korea is. They are so sheltered. We don't hear any news coming out of them. He went to them and told them about how he handled this buffoon I'm sure Kim Jong Un was talking about this buffoon oh, Trump to the people, was. and absolutely they have to fucking agree. There's no way he what he didn't. And there's no news going out telling the reality of anything. All they're getting is what he's fucking telling them. I would like to know what the North Koreans think about us as a nation oh because God. they are being really well contained in the idea of free thought they all all you get is what you get that's same way i said the other day we use the words liberty freedom and patriot in ways fucking everlasting down to our core that it's been fucking fed down our throats so long now suddenly we have to ask what a patriot is anymore what would Kim Jong-un do? 